When I was 17, me and my mates went up to Limestone Park and had a few drinks and uh, we, had, we had a carton of eggs and one of them hit an unmarked police car and then the police car chased us down Limestone Park and I got caught and yeah, I got, got charged with uh, in these, like just public nuisance pretty much. When I was like 15, uh, still in high school, throwing water bombs at cars and we hit an undercover cop and um, we didn't know until like he got out of the car and he had like, you know, his holster and stuff. And then we thought we were cool and he didn't want to chase us. And then about five minutes later, there was like five cop cars that came and we had to like jump in the lagoon and like swim away from them. <laughs> Last year, uh, in McCaw uh, Rockhampton, sorry, went out with the boys and we left the club after a few drinks and had to go to the toilet. And we walked down the street and uh, I thought I'd do the right thing, go to the toilet in the garden and the police came around the corner and Sam Martin just started laughing at me, didn't help me at all. So. Here, man, I've, I've been pulled over for having my seat too far back. Yeah, and with the, and that's, yeah, that was crazy. So he pulled me over, I had a, a $300 ticket, $286, man, for driving a car improperly or something like that. I tore it up in his face. Um, and I, t I ended up taking it to court. This was uh, two years ago, um, and it ended up being thrown out. But um, yeah, man, I pulled over for having my seat too far back. I actually once got given a fine at Esk Race Day, which we used to do every year. And it used to be um, you could like BYO urine alcohol. And I took with me um, a bottle of rum, and I hid it under some sandwiches and stuff. <laughs> And the cop asked me to open my lunch box and he could see it in there and he gave me a fine. And he dated it the wrong day, so I thought I could get out of it, but then he just came to my house and gave me a new fine. <laughs> so I had to pay that. <laughs> um, yeah, actually, uh, I lived in Sweden and um, I was traveling. I went to London and I actually got detained while I was in London. And they took my passport and they searched my bags piece by piece and they took my pictures and my fingerprints and I was in I was in I was detained for about six five to six hours and they finally let me go like and at like two AM. It was just a mix up with my visa, but everything was okay and I was really scared, but everything worked out. <laughs>